Republican Space Rangers Intergalactic War on Terror but Don't worry about collateral damage or error Cause we're nuking hate, we're spreading freedom and liberty Sometimes, Sometimes we, we kill, kill with undue glee Oh, is that your home? Sorry! Gotta complete the mission And possibly deny extraordinary edition Spreading American values Sometimes you gotta bomb an orphanage or two. Republican Space Rangers! When strangers you've never met threaten your way of life, who do you call? Republican Space Rangers! They are Butch, Commander, and Dick. When we last met the Rangers, they were in a perilous situation on the planet Sphera, encountering strange beings while heroically protecting Earth from unknown dangers. The saga continues. Republican Space Rangers, shoot first and ask questions never! Space Rangers, we have never heard of your planet Earth or your sponsor, Piss Wasser. But we welcome you to our planet. We are agrarian and do not have much... But what we have, you may share. Huh? What's he saying? Man, that's gibberish. Fuck if I know. He's speaking some kind of weird jibber-jabber space dialect with long words. Dialect smilect. I don't trust the some bitch. Besides, it looks queer to me. And if we don't fight him here, they'll follow us to America and pollute the blessed homeland. You know the drill, boys. Your strange religion and foreign ways threaten our freedoms! Dan, you look fruity like... like you got a wide stance, you know? But, but this is my home, brothers. Here it is you who is strange. Can't we all get along? What's he saying, man? This alien sure speaks crap. Hey, I blame English. Hola! Hey, listen up, shit for brains. The time for peaceful negotiations is over! You heard the boss, asshead hole. You know what time it is, baby. It's time to die. Wait. <laughs> Make sure you get the children. They'll just turn into insurgents themselves. Hey, them youngins is running into that alien orphanage. It seems to me we've uncovered a terror plot. Innocent people back home will suffer. I repeat, they will suffer. Shit. Hey there, Commander. This here nuke is armed and on your go, baby. That's 10-4. Let's get on the ship and vaporize these SLBs. Yeah, baby! Uh, all right. Another round, boys. You deserve it. Uh. You are heroes today. And I say, with a tear in my eye, Mission accomplished! Hoorah! Hoorah! Democracy is a gift to the universe. Those alien kids learned a valuable lesson today. Oh, oh, oh. I got a breach in the airlock. Oh, hey. God oh, there was a report from Fort Ass. General shit's on his way. Oh. <laughs> God damn it, soldier! You are specifically prohibited from firing off air biscuits! Hey! hey. What's that up ahead? Oh, yeah. Oh... This, uh... Wait you a idiot! You're Hold looking it. at the microwave oven! Look at the screen! Oh, I'm sorry, Commander. I was cooking me up a quesadilla. Hey, this here registers as a strange planet on the insurgent scan. Well, it's on the map. Fuck if I can pronounce the name. No surprise there. But I say we take no chances anyway. Let's give them eight kinds of hell, Butch! Fire it off! With pleasure, sir! <laughs> I never get tired of seeing that. Well done, fellers. Put a note in the log. Encounter terrorist threat. Commence to liquidize same enemy. Freed mankind. And I'm recommending both of you sons of bitches for some more medals and shit. Oh, thank you, Commander. Hey, listen, can we, uh, can we shower together later? Indubitably. But only after we play space volleyball and work ourselves up a man-sized sweat. Oh, man, y'all know I ain't good at no volleyball. Hush. Don't ruin it. It's too tender. Oh, I got something on the insurgent scan again. Hey, readings indicate minerals and gold. <laughs> well, boys, lock and load. Let's have ourselves a look-see. What do you say? Remember, if we meet any strangers, kill them! 
I bet these punks have no capacity whatsoever for peaceful coexistence, drive through liquor stores, gun shops, or the democratic freedom to have their votes discarded in swamps. Shit, they better learn how to pray in school. Oh, give it a rest. They're fucking savages, dick. Hey, here's one now. The gods were right. You've come. Welcome to our peaceful land of plenty. What is he saying? This son of a bitch doesn't even speak American. Yes, I do. I said welcome. Ow! You prick! You shot me in the tentacle! No problem. It will grow back. Listen, I forgive you, brother. Carrying around the burden of hate is worse for me than those I despise. What on God's green earth is he saying? I don't know. Sound like some Tai Chi Chuan Fandango transvestite bullshit. I don't know. I was thinking the exact same thing. See, I recognize some of the words, but the sentiment seem simplistic and, well, foreign, if you will. I don't understand what anybody's saying. I just want to shoot. Enemies out there, boys. The enemies out there. No. The enemy's inside. Listen, guys, welcome. We've arranged a welcome party with a tequila slide. Good times. We'll get started with massages from attractive she-aliens. Then, after hand release, we'll You better stop trying to buy my men off with your women. Ditto. Yeah, I hate women. Oh, uh, sorry. We mean no offense. Listen, we really need your help. We are a loving, peaceful race. Last menstrual moon cycle, an evil race of aliens invaded and began imposing their will on us. They enslave many of my people, steal our natural resources with no-bid contracts while destroying our culture. Can you help? Oh, no. Here comes one of them now. What are you saying, shattered scum? I was explaining to these manly space rangers how you've enslaved my people. Of course we have. You've got resources we need, and besides which, we are evil and greedy. <laughs> I like this little guy. He's speaking a lot of sense, know what I mean? Hey, you want to go bass fishing? Man, what's he saying? My God, you are a fucking moron. Listen, you two, please. These evil aliens are destroying our people and culture. You're weak. You deserve to suffer. He's got leadership skills on him, too. This little valor's incredible. Hey, Commander, awaiting your orders. Hell, our mission is clear as mud, boys. And I do not believe in any manner of deviation. Except, of course, for that one night in college when... We had one too many wine spritzers. Are you calling me a deviant boy? No, 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 no. Therefore, we must travel through space, meet strangers, and kill them good. For democracy and liberty. Hurrah! But I can give you wisdom. And I can make you rich. All right, I've heard enough of this shit. You know the drill, fellas. No, 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 no. Uh, no. Cook them. that son of a bitch with shock and all means. You did a great job, boys. I'm proud of you. Oh, damn it, dick. I told you no bop on the baloney in outer space. Sorry, Commander, but this soldier is unable to stop thinking about your warm, hairy embrace. Republican Space Rangers! Republican Rangers of Space... Oh, shit. Uh, wait. God damn it! When primitives light years away threaten their way of life, the Republican Space Rangers will be there to make sure democracy wins again. Republican Space Rangers. Episode 456, Trouble Brewing Down South. I tell you what, boys, there is nothing like barbecue space chicken to make you feel patriotic. Gentlemen, we are on the front lines of freedom right here. This is where our civilization ends and a universe of untold savagery begins. Any illegal alien immigrants try to sneak through this checkpoint, our standing orders are to deport them permanently to H.E. Double Toothpicks. <laughs> Amen. Hoorah. <laughs> Shut up and get tender, bitches. Hey, uh, how come I can hear that gunshot? You know, sound don't travel through no space. Huh? Oh, god damn it, 
But you're fucking up our character continuity. You're supposed to be dumb as sticks. I'm just saying, all them space movies you hear, you know, with them lasers and ships flying by, but you can't hear nothing in space for real. Space is a vacuum cleaner full of dark matter and impossibly dense. I got some impossibly dense dark matter for you. Mm -mm. Dinner's ready, boys. <laughs> oh, holy snap, an asshole. Hey, look at you, mister. Fucking self-improvement elitist with your fancy learning. Hey, look, I got all the educations I need. It's called a gun. Holster that weapon, soldier. Need I remind you that dark matter is what we're supposed to stop from creeping into the blessed homeland? Butch, what are you, some kind of elite son of a bitch now? Yeah, living up in your ivory tower listening to your jam bands and your rap music and whatnot? Are you social networking on me, boy? Uh, Commander, I, I read all this on them internet. Internet? So help me, you better not have yourself a blog, boy. The internets? Well, she ain't for learning. She's for posting unsubstantiated lies on message boards, calling people fags and fart and shit. Do you read me? Yes, uh, sir. Uh, and chatting with underage girls with large hairy hands and Adam's apples and thick ankles that don't shave. Uh, anyway... You two shut your beer holes and be on the lookout for illegal immigrants. They're a scourge, I tell you, gentlemen. Why, when my people came to this country, the last thing they wanted was to be joined by a lot of foreigners once the place was full. It's just like the Constitution says. We the freaking people. I repeat, we the freaking motherfucking people. Uh oh Hey, we got a live one there, fellas. Whoa! Incoming combat! Lock and load, prepare to fire, boys! On my command! Yeah! Yeah! Ow, baby! You try to soil this distant outpost of the homeland with your funny language of merengue hoo-ha, and I'll shoot a load right in your fart box, boy! Uh, yeah. Anyway, it's another great day for spreading freedom, boys! What say we hit the hay? Oh, but before we go... Julio, Ivan, Ming Ho, get your sorry tentacled arses out here on the double! Si, sí, senor commander. Oh, Julio, 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 we said it a million fucking times. Let me be very clear. God speaks English. My Bible is in English. I am English. This am Englandish. Speak fucking English! Si, si, sorry, senor bossman. England very pretty. Is very pretty! Cut the crap, the two of you! England is full of homos! Anyways, listen up, Julio! While me and the real heroes catch some Z's, you zeros give the ship a little cleaning and a good once over! You people are good at that, aren't you? Listen up, my alien friend! The American dream begins under the table! I'm taxed at a dollar fifty an hour. You don't like it? I'm calling immigration come morning. Si, sí, senor. All right, now, vamos, amigos. <laughs> Damn heathen language makes my mouth taste like turd just speaking it. Hit the fucking rack, boys. Commander, you asleep? What? Uh, grab your socks, it's a ra- What? What the hell are you doing in my bunk, soldier? Hi. Uh, I got cold, uh, and I keep thinking I hear crickets, you know? Oh, god damn it, Dick, those ain't crickets! That's my new fangled sleep machine! So you play soothing sounds that help me sleep. Comforting things like the sound of crickets, or rifles cocking, or aliens cowering, or flags unfurling. Now get your ass back to your bunk and get some shut eye, soldier! That's an order! Leave my teddy bear. Oh, thank you so much for coming. My family is starving. So I, I brought you some beans. Y'all people like that, right, Beans? Well, anything. Oh, <laughs> I'm so confused. But why? Well, you're filthy alien scum. And I got a mandate here from the Lord God Almighty and Weasel News to kill you, but... 
I just want me a new friend. Will you be my little buddy? Well, I... Uh, I, I don't know. I, what do we have in common? I like reading and art and philosophy and studying the universe. What do you like? I like TV and breakfast buffets and mega churches and rodeo and killing people. Only, I don't really like that last part. I'm so confused, alien scum buddy. I'm all alone. <laughs> Please, please, what about the other two psychotic rednecks in there? The one with the murderous rage and the inbred one always complaining about his sweaty groin? They seem like your kind of people. Oh, yeah, man. I mean, uh, I like Butch and the Commander and all that, but we don't have so much in common no more. That's because we ain't but fucking queers! Oh, shit. <gasps> Unlike you and this intellectual elitist cocksucker! I beg your pardon. Consorting with the enemy, huh? Giving him comfort, are you? You might as well be pink socking the motherfucker! Hurrah! Hey, y'all been there since beans, haven't you? Hey, excuse me, but how can I be homosexual? I had 14 kids. That is, until you killed most of them! Exactly, motherfucker! Natural selection's what we call it! The way the good lord intended it! Would have been all of them dead if my plasma gun hadn't locked. It's all a clever design, my alien friend. Teach the controversy. Hey, stop staring at my penis. Oh, please. Fuck you, you fudge-packing alien scum. Get this straight, boy. I ain't marrying you because it's it's illegal. And, and fuck you, butch. Hey, I bet that alien's demon seed is going to burn its way into your brain. It's got control of you, Butch. No, Dick. Commander, he, he, he's just my my friend. You friend? Harsh shit, you gas motherfucker. Dick, new orders. We got queers to kill. Butch likes alien cock. Uh, Butch, hurry this way. Hey, Butch. Just because you suck cock, it don't make you gay as long as the lights are off. I grew up on a farm. Where are these homos? Oh! There they are! They're getting away! I can't believe I've become a traitor. We're like outlaws now. You gonna call me the bandit? Oh, they'll probably hang you. Oh, no. I didn't join the Space Marines for this. I signed up to protect Earth and kill foreigners and have video games made about me. Life is complicated. I know, I saw that commercial. Oh, man, it's them! We got a Smokey on her backside, little buddy! Have mercy! Listen up, Butch! Your backside is really gonna be smoking when I'm done with you, do you read me over? Yeah! You stop your poon hanging around with insurgents! You are threatening our way of life! You shall be liquidated like bad debt! With no rescue bill inside, motherfucker! Insurgents? Prepare to die! Oh, piss off, dickhead. Watch this! I call it Operation Shitstorm in a Basket! Oh! Oh, shit! All systems are offline! Ah! This can mean only one thing! What? Cyber terrorism! <laughs> but We're running out of air in here! It's like that choking game I like to play with my dad. Only it's real. We've got to save your friends. Well, they called me gay. Maybe I'll we'll just let them die. It's called transference, buddy. It's basic Jungian psychology from your planet. We have to save those morons or we'll be just as bad as they. Well, okay, then. Hey, y'all need to get in the stamina vascular airlock and hit the eject button. We'll catch it. I'm going out like I began. Hoorah, motherfucker! Whoa! Will the commander and Dick explode in the vacuum of space? Will Butch become a granola-eating liberal pinko? Will the commander offend any other minorities? Taking a handicapped woman against her will! Will the alien sign a book deal with a women's magazine discussing conflict resolution in your marriage? Will liberals ever stop hating America? Find out next time, only on Republican Space Rangers! Republican Space Rangers! We join the Rangers ship floating in an uncharted nebula deep in the black depths of space.
Detected. Baby batter. Detected. Whoa. What? Huh? Law. Anybody see a cat running around here? Ugh. What cat? Man, the one is shit in my mouth. I don't know. Oh, god damn, it's hot in the chubby girl's undercarriage in here. I got fucking vapor locked in my shorts. You, tin can, what the hell is going on here anyway? The atmospheric regulator is offline. You've been in cryosleep for eight years. Eight years? Dick, you dumb shit! You programmed the cryogenic alarm clock wrong in the boring part of the last episode! It was supposed to be eight hours, not eight years! Huh? Ow! Ow! Oh, hey, why are y'all staring at me? Oh no! I must have put the sun lamp setting on for eight years too! Now I'm a metrosexual! I ought to send your fake bank ass out the airlock! Log into the ship's computer, soldier sissy pants. That's an order. <laughs> Sir, I forgot my damn password. Now we'll never get the ship started. Hey, Dick, try doggy balls four. Hey, good. Oh, yeah. Uh, how do you spell four? Uh, no, no, that ain't it. Uh, all right, uh, give a clown pocket a whirl. <laughs> no, no. No, not that either. Try pink harmonica. No, no. Take, take over, fat princess. Nah. Oh, what the fuck was it, boy? I think the password has been reset. Shit. Allow me to type it in. Huh? What the hell is that word? That looks like Latin faggot shit to me. Must be one of them random letter generators. Anyway. <laughs> Oh, no! It has been eight years. Everyone's defriended me. I've missed out on all that blogging and telling people what I hate about standing in line at the grocery store. Shut <laughs> your bar hole, super shopper! Social networking is for queers! A real man hates himself silently and his friends openly. Plus, you were getting too goddamn carried away with that shit! <laughs> Say cheese! Smile, dirt star! Oh, God damn it, Butch! Uh, hey, y'all. We have orders to return to Earth immediately. Hoorah! In fact, we's a little late. These orders are five years old. I don't gotta hear that twice, boys. Let's hit it! I can't wait to head back to the good old U.S. of A. and make me some motorboat sounds between a couple of genuine American fake silicone hooters! Booyah! Yeah! <laughs> That's me and my mother. Make a bronze statue of us as heroes. Tell you what, my action figure better have a four-foot inflatable cock, cause I hey. wanna. Hey, hey, where is everybody? Where's the welcome party? Who's this guy? Welcome back, service people. Here, have some medals. Your country is proud of you. Please sign here to give up your rights to a pension. It's your patriotic duty. A lot has changed on Earth and the military in the past eight years. First, we'll need your weapons, boys. What? Man, these must be outdated. Oh, I can't wait to get my new gun. Y'all have one that'll shatter an alien's final column, but leave them conscious so I can go them before crushing the life out of them with my boot. Yeah, yeah, or, or, or a gun that blows the enemy's clothes off like a like a nude bomb, yeah. you know? <laughs> then you'd know if the bad guys have a gun. You shut it, soldier. Everyone knows terrorists hide guns in their butts. <laughs> That's why you look there first. Uh, no, actually, gentlemen, here are your new weapons. What? Now, how holy hell is this? Where's the trigger? That's an excellent question. It is a non-lethal conflict resolution device. Too many enemy combatants were harmed through crude projectile-based weaponry. These project positive affirmations that help you bridge the gap and solve matters peacefully. Well, give me the goddamn thing. It's... Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, this is a joke, right? A what? A, a joke, Bubba! A joke. Oh, yes, yeah. I'm sorry. Jokes were outlawed several years ago. Too many parents' groups were getting offended. 
This is a genuine American peacemaker. It makes peace and encourages participants in a conflict to relax and shed their angry selves before reconvening around a conference table in HR to discuss problems. Well, how the hell am I supposed to get Poon Job to tell me where the next terror plot is with this thing? Hell, we need flamethrowers and duct tape and, ooh, waterboarding. Oh, and electric nipple clamps. Yeah! Yeah, yeah, that's the best part of it. them nipples. And naked human pyramids. Ooh! Uh, yes, we don't facilitate torture anymore. What? What the wet patch of piss are you talking about, soldier? Torture works! <laughs> Just watch this. Uh, hey, Uncle uh, Buddy. Oh, oh Uncle! <laughs> uh, now say my uncle touched me funny. <laughs> Dick's uncle touched him funny. Hey, hey, you shut your mouth. That's me and Pawpaw's secret. Oh, mercy. I'm afraid you need to attend a sensitivity retraining seminar. Report to human and other equal species resources. Welcome, servicemen, women, and all other equal species. You know, serving the universe as guardians and protectors is not the simple job it once was, not by a long shot. I mean, no longer can you shoot a person in the face and post the video of it on the internet. Now, we are conflict resolvers engaged in an equal partnership with all people. The word is non Violence. Let's do a little question as an example. Okay, if an alien horde has threatened your ship, how do you respond? Oh, 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 oh okay, okay, you. Oh, uh, damn. I liquidize them, the commander awards me a medal, we shower together, then drink till we black out, and I wake up in nothing but my socks. Uh, oh, wrong answer. Shame on you. Okay, who's oh, next? Oh, uh, yes. Wait. Okay, I asked them to stop. Good. And then I vaporize them. And then I feel bad about it afterwards. Good. Commander calls me a fag, and we shower and play volleyball. <sighs> well, it's better, but it's still wrong. Oh, I got this. I got this. Got this, motherfuckers. Let me think. Okay. I light a cigar. Eh, no, sorry. Smoking is illegal and bad for your health. What? Okay, okay. I beat their children, stick them on the front of my spaceship like a human shield, then nuke the entire fucking planet into next week. No! Wrong answer! I'm afraid I'll have to revoke your medals and label you all as traitors. <gasps> what? I'm sorry, guys. I really what? am. You, you, you can't just do that. I am a patriot. My favorite beer even says so. And you, you're just a goddamn filthy fucking alien. <gasps> oh, I'm an equal opportunities co-worker. Besides, for your information, our president is an alien. <laughs> And that's what my great uncle taught me. True story. So the fact is, you're probably incorrect. Now, I'm not waffling here. I'm, I'm distracting. Trust me. I know I've never had a real job, but I still understand the economy a darn sight better than you do because of my deep, mellifluous voice. Say, uh, would you like a photograph of me in a swimsuit? <laughs> anyway, from now on, America is all about inclusion, people. And that means lots of taxation and, first and foremost, changing the american flag so let me unveil your new flag my god the president's a goddamn homo communist and an alien come on boys let's get the hell out of here booyah but you haven't finished your sensitivity training <laughs> i think we're about done with that shit sayonara sweet cheeks Oh, for fuck's sake. Guys, guys, come back. Can we talk about this? What we gonna do? Well, as patriots and Americans, we are left with only one option. We gotta kill the president or set off a terrorist attack and blame it on brown people. That's pretty heavy. God damn it, we're heroes, son, not diplomats. The right and proper thing to do is to shoot the democratically elected bastard before he changes anything else in this hellhole. We've done it in plenty of other countries, and it worked out great. Yeah, fuck democracy. <laughs> yeah, we only ever liked that shit when it worked for us anyway. Okay, fellas, gather around. Here's the plan. This is so exciting. Whiffle, 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 whiffle. Uh, 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 Mr. President? Mr. President, sir? 
could y'all stop for a minute? I just wanted to talk to you about writing autobiographies. <laughs> Why, <laughs> that happens to be my favorite topic. <laughs> interesting, very interesting, but at the same time, very important. Hitch your wagon to change. <laughs> I'm not quite sure what I think, but uh, I agree with what you say. <laughs> Now, Dick! Uh, uh, tell us more, Mr. President! Sweet Jesus! I've been hit! Little man down! Little man down! Did I get him? Hey, did I get him? You saved my life! You saved my life! Make this man a hero! I think I'll write about you in my next autobiography. And, and, and thus it happened. I was reconciled with the hillbillies, and my identity was complete. I was truly all things to all people, man, beast, alien, and redneck alike. I am the American dream. I ain't gonna make it. You shot the only thing I ever loved. Y'all have to be a liberal now, Commander. You ain't got no Johnson. Quick, revive me. <laughs> God damn it, Dick, get off of me. Will the commander's toucher be saved? Will the president know how close he came to death? Will his next autobiography be as boring as the previous ones? How will this new liberal world treat our heroes? Find out next time, only on Republican Space Rangers and Rangerettes. Republican Space Rangers is an equal opportunity employer. Violence, sexism, or humor in the workplace will not be tolerated. What's going on YouTube? It's Jose Zerano right here. Of Jose Zerano Special Vehicles. Thank you so much for watching from uh, Republican Space Rangers on the TV show from GTA 4. So before we end this video, let's say hi to one of my friends. Hey there, YouTube. is Mr. Shine. Question girl right here. Electric man over here. And Stinky man. Well, but at the same time, you see... Butch Burb three times and Dick Fars two times in a row when the spacecraft crash landing on the statue because he's unemployed. He went to the White House, but don't try this at home. Um, Mr. Shine, do you think Butch burps three times or more? Actually, he burped three times. That was my answer. Very good. Burping too much that make you pass pass out. Might be a homo communist. You see, Commander got shot in the ball, like you, kid. Even though don't buy weapons at school, no longer post the internet and shooting the person in the head. And even starving. Their family starving. And give someone food. You can bring some some person anytime you want. When they cost money. Actually they call strangers. Strangers and freaks. That must be a mind nightmare. Man you see. A squid. Like an alien. With the missing eye. Like a light. And snap the arm off with a flag. Do you think so? Stinky guy. Yes. I'm sure it snap all on the arm and comes blood out. Snapping the arm off with the knife or a weapon that cause injuries, but do not try this at home. It's gonna be a good nightmare for, for all of us. Even play with it is gonna be too dangerous. If you do that, you'll be suspended or expelled at school. I agree with what you guys said. So letter man, do you think the Russia, Mexican, and Asia are right to clean the spacecraft. Yes, it cleaned the spacecraft. When they need to clean when Commander Dick fell asleep with Butch. As you might know, Butch sneak out the spacecraft and you see the mouthless and armless alien, the family starving. I remember that the alien said that is until you kill most of these children. He has 14 kids and become a homosexual. Um, question no girl. You have a homosexual thing? Not actually. 
homosexual is gonna be a sexy person in the entire world. This must be Jose Zerrano. That must be you. Man, I already know. I always have a homosexual and a muscular kid in the entire world. I do agree with that. I kind of a homosexual person. So, with this soda boy? He drinks too much soda, he drinks everything, and burps so loud. I know who it is. It's a soda boy. Soda boy, get over here. I'm here. What is it? Jose Serrano thinks that you drink everything. Hey, he, do he doesn't drink oils, even the carbon dioxide and the radioactive things. It gets poisonous. Nightmares. I get scared of oil, radioactive, and poisonous thing. Will. I always drink soda. I always drinking unhealthy waters, unhealthy stuff, and even the milkshake. I always get full, and I try to eat something else. That's the humble communist. That's what I'm talking about. So how do you know you like Republican Space Ranger? Was it cool though? It was. A little bit relaxing. The peaceful planet is gonna be so much fun. If I see nothing but the uh, ending with the squid. I always see that talking the aliens are she and after hand release. Exactly, kid. Don't you think about democracy and liberty? That the Butch and Dick said it earlier. I see the spacecraft goes flaccid. It went flaccid and it caused damage and run out of air. I remember that the Mexican said England very pretty, but it's not. It's on Europe. Good thinking, Mr. Shine. Alright, let's end this video. Say goodbye to my friends. Subscribe to his channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe to his channel. Follow him on Instagram. Follow him on YouTube. And like, subscribe, and thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time of Jose Serrano Special Vehicles.